Okay, so I do see that there has been some enhancements with the uh, scaling that is being done. Um, it's uh, it, it's definitely an improvement. However, I just want to give you an example of where things are still going wrong here. Um, so I'm going to open up a brand new document in Wirecast. Um, and then what I have is I'm actually currently running just a test demo thing for other purposes unrelated, but at least I have um, NDI signals on the network. So if I go into network and then the streamer, and I'm going to just pull in the VLC feed, which should be just a running playlist at 1080. Uh, so this is going to come in, you're going to see it is definitely coming in and it's picking the full screen, which great. There's a 1080p signal finally coming in at what the canvas is. That is absolutely an improvement. So for that, I'm, I'm very happy. If I, I'm going to push that live and we're good there. Um, however, say it's a different resolution. So what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to go into the source here and I'm going to say change this to a local source. So I'm going to change this to um, a local one, which is just a VLC uh, incoming one that I have um, that is currently uh, over here and I'm going to start playing a video. So this video here is 1920 by 1080, 60 frames a second and I'm going to say network pull in the gaming VLC. So it's going to reconnect to this. Um, and you'll see, I haven't done any different thing, anything different here. Um, that video is still technically playing at full screen. However, this video here, uh, that just newly imported, is now 72,000% scaled. Um, I haven't changed anything other than just replacing the footage. So that's very bizarre. If I go and I say scale to fit, clearly this is just the video that's coming in here. Um, it's just a conference that I helped produce. Um, so that's fine, sure, okay. I've replaced the footage, it's still playing original. I get that, you're not modifying the update and updating whatever's live. I kind of actually appreciate that. Um, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna push that forward so that it is over here. So now I have this 1080p signal that's coming in just from VLC as a playlist that's 1920 by 1080. Um, now, obviously I had issues with it coming in at like an unreasonable scale. Um, if I go and I see, wait, let's jump over to a next video. So interestingly, that footage is actually stopped even though it's being uh, continued to play. Um, in fact, I'm going to open up monitor just as a, a thing later on so that we'll be able to tell. Um, but you'll see the live view is now scaled down and the preview is scaled perfectly. Like this is what I would expect. I'd expect the height of it to stay the same. That's oh, kind of awkward. Hopefully I don't get demonetized. It's a cartoon. It's funny. It's That's a humor thing. Um, damn it. Why did that have to come up? Um, so I'm, what I'm going to do over here is I'm going to pull up that VLC. Um, and just pull that cartoon up right there, and you'll see that's what's happening there. Um, now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump to the end of this clip. Uh, so I'm gonna jump basically with about 20 seconds left. It's going through the credits here, and I've got a secondary footage here. So again, I'm gonna make that go full screen. Um, when it gets to the end of this footage, what's gonna end up happening is you're gonna see the monitor is gonna preview what it should be, and Wirecast is gonna freeze up until the scale comes in, and then the scale is gonna be completely off again. So as it completes, right. So I've got the footage now playing in the monitor. It's properly playing, and you'll see Wirecast is definitely not correct. Um, there was a delay in picking that up, and the scale is incorrect. Um, so again, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, come over to VLC, and I'm going to Double click on this just so that you can see the type of delay. So double click right now. So you'll see the footage is definitely being played back now in monitor before it is in uh, Wirecast. And the scale has kept what it was previously. So again, all I'm gonna do is I'm going to go and I'm going to say double click on that one. So it's now playing, the audio is playing, but Wirecast has a massive delay and is incorrectly scaled.